The Blueprint for Safety has been funded for almost three years now and has been showing results, and the appropriate corrections to help the community are being figured out. So finding those what we call gaps in the process, we try to figure out ways to fix them and put that down to policy and to protocol. This program has been showing a lot of promise within the Women's Center and the difference it is making within the community. I definitely think they have. I mean, just the criminal justice practitioners, meaning law enforcement, calling us uh, right away to be able to make that connection with the victim is huge, and that number of calls coming into the Harbor House has significantly increased. Not only is this program working, but it has been very effective due to the partnership that has allowed this program to flourish. The beauty of the blueprint is that it's not just a theory, it's not just, you know, social policy, it's actually based upon research that we know is effective and, and, and works. This is a collaboration between law enforcement and the prosecutors part of law enforcement although our role is a little different and with our community-based uh, advocacy program run through the through the women's center and that partnership has really made this project work reporting from marquette county i'm dan callahan from abc 10 and the cw5